You know, as a parent, one of the great challenges is to look into the face of your child and imagine what they'll be like when they become adults. But there's a lot of influence in your child's life. Between the time that they're at home with you and you're the only influence in their life until they become adults, there is this turbulent water of adolescence. The question is, how do you get them from being a child to an adult? And what Sheila and I discovered is if we could put them in a student ministry vehicle, a boat, an arc of safety that would get them across the turbulent waters of adolescence from childhood to adulthood, then they would arrive safely on the shore and be an adult ready for life. The goal of GSM, honestly, bottom line, is helping students take their next step towards Christ together. That is the whole reason GSM exists. So we really focus on trying to get kids connected. We want them to feel loved. Relationships are huge in GSM. We look at scripture and Jesus was with his disciples all the time. It's with, with, with. And that's so huge when uh, you're trying to help people grow closer to Jesus. It's walking next to them with mentorship and accountability and sharing your experiences with kids. It's, it's relational. My favorite thing about GSM is that there's so many people that you can talk to if you're having problems. Well, it's just a great experience to like meet people and get closer to God. It's like the one time a week that you can go and really be honest and um, just be yourself and not feel like anybody's judging you. One of the awesome things about GSM is the closeness of the group. Um, it really becomes a family, whether it's stuff on the weekends or during the weekdays. We love being with each other, um, and whether that's on mission trips where we go closer. You go on a mission trip and you come back with 60 of your new closest friends, and uh, that's one of my favorite parts about GSM is just uh, the close-knit of the group and the family feel that it has. Throughout the school year, GSM does a regular gathering on Sunday nights, uh, but there's so much more beyond that. We have regular retreats throughout the year, whereas the chance like during the school year, just to hit pause, to get away from the school and the homework and the assignments and all the stuff you have going on, and pause during the year. We also do GSM camp in the summer, which is just a phenomenal week. It's an amazing chance uh, for students to go up and have an amazing overnight camp experience in the summer as we explore faith and what it means uh, to follow Jesus. And, and many students, including myself, took their first step of faith at camp as they gave their lives to Jesus. It's the most amazing thing when I see students um, take ownership of their faith when they are walking with Jesus. Even if they're struggling, I still know that something's good going to come out of it. The heart and soul behind GSM is helping kids take their next steps towards Christ. And so if any way we can help a kid take their next step towards Christ on the weekend, we're going to do everything we can to make that happen. Parents love their kids, and one of the highest priorities all parents have is putting their kids under the influence of people they trust. Well, that's my priority as well. And the staff that we have assimilated at Granger Community Church has my absolute confidence. John and Chuck and Jessica, the whole team, and all the volunteers that we carefully vet, they are trustworthy. I would trust them with my kids. I do. And you can trust them with yours. My heart beats for students. My heart beats for helping them in life, helping them grow towards Jesus. Students today are making decisions that will shape their tomorrow. They are deciding now which way to point their feet so that in five years, 10 years, they're gonna end up closer to Jesus or not. And so they're making those decisions today. And that's why it's so important uh, to get your students plugged into GSM or a mission trip or camp or whatever it is. And it's worth a sacrifice. I am persuaded that one of the most important things that we can do in the church is reach the next generation with the authentic love of Jesus. When a kid is making his own decisions, when she is deciding for herself what she'll believe for the rest of her days, who she'll trust and who she'll follow, we need to make sure that our kids learn about Jesus Christ. That's what student ministry is all about.